sound me freely. Hello again, my friend. Have you seen a tiny rocking horse fly go by? My, those flowers really are wonderful. Did you see the Cheshire Cat? Why, he's disappeared again. I do believe you're looking at me. You needn't pretend we haven't met before. And I won't neglect my manners by not welcoming you back. Goodbye. See you in Wonderland. Always are the Queen's ways. You'd better learn quickly or you might just lose your head. How very curious. It seems to be raining. I was thinking of sending you an invitation so you would come back and see me again. Did you enjoy the Mad Hatter's tea party? <laughs> Such silliness. <laughs> well, perhaps I shall go this way. Or, or this way. Oh dear, everything's so confusing. Please, madam, might I have a word? Oh, a garden. Hmm, what a pleasant place to daydream. Everyone seems so very friendly in this world. Perhaps I shall meet a friendly howdy-do bird today. I simply must speak with you. Goodness, even my cat Dinah has more to say than you do. It's very rude to stand and stare, you know. I can't remember some things as I used to, but I always remember you. Now this is curious. If these flowers could talk, each little bud would say welcome back. Oh dear, I seem to have lost my cat Dinah. What would I do in this peculiar place without you to talk to? Speak to the flowers, I suppose. How doth the little busy bee improve each... Oh, <laughs> what nonsense, reciting a poem about a bee. Welcome back. Did you happen upon the Mad Hatter today? I suppose I should just stand here. Goodness, whatever will happen next? Oh, um, excuse me, miss. My, I've seen flowers sing before, but I've never seen them grow like that. Oh, you mustn't be shy with me. Why, I'm as harmless as a bread and butterfly. Well... Watering nothing is nothing but nonsense. I suppose you would have better luck watering the roses. Oh, this is such a lovely place. If I'm dreaming, I hope I sleep a little while longer. If Tweedledee and Tweedledum should wander by, pay no attention to them. They make no sense at all. I wonder if the walrus and the carpenter are out again, looking for poor little oysters. Oh, you must tell me of your adventures. I can't possibly think of anything else until you do. There's simply not enough red for the castle in this land to be the Queen's castle. Yoo-hoo! Over here, please! Pardon me, but do you mind? How peculiar! Hello! I beg your pardon! Yes, yes, of course I remember you. You're that boy I met today. It really is a wonderland, isn't it? Oh, sir, could I trouble you for a moment? Well, that is curious. I was just thinking of you. It's good manners to allow you to speak first. Oh. Oh! Why are you pointing that at me? That white rabbit is always running off somewhere. Isn't it lovely to share another moment together? Just you and me. No, oh, you and I. Oh, you needn't be afraid. It's a very soft landing. <laughs> I wonder if these flowers talk. I can't put this more clearly, for it isn't clear to me. But I do believe you've been here before. What a fuss. It's me, Alice. Goodness. You know, it's good advice to stay where you are until someone finds you. And now you've found me. Hello again. I was beginning to wonder if you'd taken a drink from that bottle that says drink me. Hmm, I wonder if this is where the white rabbit went. I think we shall become very good friends, don't you, dear? Goodness, if you keep coming back here, you'll never get anywhere, will you? Goodness! 
Was that the white rabbit? If this were my world, I would politely give directions to anyone who asked me. But no one has asked me. Welcome back, miss. Well, it is good that the sun is out. At least I know which way is up. <laughs> Why, surely you must have something to say. Hello again, my friend. Have you seen the white rabbit while you were away? If you've never fallen down a rabbit hole before, well, it's a very curious adventure. Why does the white rabbit insist on calling me Marianne? Why, I don't think I look at all like a Marianne. It would be so nice if one of us would begin a pleasant conversation. Isn't the queen dreadfully pompous? And that poor deck of cards, always being shuffled about. You needn't worry. It's rather a gentle fall. This land is rather strange. I was beginning to wonder why I was here. Until you came back to visit. Please don't hurry off. Mind you, don't forget to look up. Yoo-hoo! Stop! Please stop! You're here to see me? How kind. It is quite nice to see you again, sir. Oh dear, I don't have an umbrella. I wonder why everyone is in such a hurry. Perhaps the queen is shouting off with their heads again. That could lead to trouble. Now that you're back, young man, you won't be running off again, will you? Would you like me to stand like this? The caterpillar should appreciate this lovely tree. That is, if he were here. Which, of course, he isn't. Oh, what a dreadful noise! A very merry unbirthday to you. Do you recite any poems? I know I do. If Tweedledee and Tweedledum should come here, they will most certainly confuse everyone. I've just been to the silliest tea party, and I didn't even have any tea. That's odd. The Cheshire Cat was just here a moment ago. If I see the White Rabbit again, I must ask him why he keeps running away. Well, don't you think I ought to know when I've met a young man before? Now, where have you been hiding? How curious. I thought you came to speak to me. Oh, I'm so glad to see you again. I was afraid that dreadful queen had invited you to a game of croquet. In my world, cats wouldn't say meow. They'd say yes, Miss Alice. Look, the white rabbit. It is awfully loud. Well, it seems that some people appreciate being in a spin. I'm so glad you're not like the white rabbit. He always runs away, but you always return. Why, I do suppose you could be a fine gentleman when you grow up. Please, after you. What a well-mannered boy to call on me again. Oh, dear, my ears. I've seen many amazing things here, but still. For goodness sake, doesn't anyone stop to talk anymore? Why, how nice to see you again. Hello again, dear. My sister must be wondering where I am. But you're much more fun than her history lessons. Have you ever seen anywhere so peculiar in all your life? Oh, hello there. Young boy, I have some very good advice for you. Oh, it's so nice to see a friendly face again. I've been completely surrounded by nonsense. Hello again, miss. Tell me, you wouldn't mistake me for a wildflower, would you? Remember, I know how to get to Wonderland. Curiouser and curiouser. Oh, my dear friend, you just missed the Cheshire Cat. Hmm, all this waiting. You're making me very curious. Very curious indeed. Now, where could that Cheshire Cat be? If you see a smile hanging in the middle of nowhere, he's sure to be close by. Now, let's see. For tea, we'll be meeting the Mad Hatter. The March Hare and the Dormouse. Of course, he'll be in his teapot again. You look a bit taller this time. Have you been eating the biscuits in Wonderland? 
It's so nice that we can share these little visits together. I think my cat Dinah would be rather fond of you too. How nice to share a pleasant visit again, young sir. How doth the little crocodile improve this shining tail and pour the waters of the... Oh, dear, I am rather thirsty. Oh, thank goodness. Someone I can talk to who isn't completely mad. Thank you for coming back, sir. You do have very nice manners. Oh, I do hope my pinafore isn't wrinkled. One cannot play a proper game of croquet with a hedgehog. It's simply nonsense. <laughs>